This is brass and history. Yeah. Brass yeah. at some yeah. point, we're going to need your ass. Yeah. 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 Hey, Redman, please make a bread chance. Yeah. 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 That's how they know about Branson, because I was blowing them big jars and digging them. was like, where you getting them jars from? Mm. And I was like, Redman's uptown Branson mm. at the candy store. <laughs> the candy store. <laughs> the lollipops. Exactly. The yeah. Strawberry lollipops. Those was, those was hard. I What's still... my man, man? Uh, Eddie. Eddie. R.I.P. Eddie, Eddie, Eddie man. Yeah, yeah. Eddie. Back there with the candy, man. And I forgot the other, the young one. Um, I think it was Jay. No, 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 I forgot his name. But I know Eddie. Eddie, yeah. God bless the dead. Always there. Um, that's when we used to bump heads 3, 4 in the morning out there. But before, before the... Eddie passed, that's when I knew that they had, like, some type of payola shit. It's because one of my homies had died from Queens, and we went up there to get some bud. We had all the champagne, and we bumped all, we bought all the champagne right in front of Branson, and the police just drove by. Right. They didn't say nothing. We smoked all the weed. That we had. You gotta think about it. That spot was right around the corner, dog. For like, oh yeah, right around the police station was right oh, yeah. around the corner. Police station right, right there. Chopper Bridge yeah. right here. The Bronx to the left. The, no, uh, the, the fish store, one forty fifth, and the Saint oh, Nick's right there to the right. And sometimes you come you out there. That that see, yeah, yeah, there's wild there. people out there. You know what I'm saying? So you will come out there sometimes two in the morning, and it just be mm. 10, 15, 20 people out there. Mm. You go about weed, and you sit there for an hour, just talk to Ed or Branson, pull up on you. You be out there for two hours. You go inside, sit with him. Yeah, Branson. Yeah, Branson. He used to Pop catch you like that all the time. And you'll sit with him all day because he'll get you a free job. Yep. Yeah, sit there and talk to him two, for two hours. He'll yep. get you a half an hour to go home with. Yep. So, um, <laughs> your relationship oh, with, 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 with Little Kim, mm -hmm. I see recently now it's it's prepared. Back then, how was it? If Well, okay, I don't know if it's fair to say that there was ever a full relationship ever built. But mm -hmm. in the beginning, mm -hmm. um, you know, I even see pictures. I'm like, oh, damn, I remember that. Like, you know, I definitely, once I realized this is big artist right. who I've been hearing about, that's a part of the crew. Because I met the guys first. Right. I think the first time I saw Kim was at the Big Papa video shoot. Okay. And I was like, who is that girl? And they was like, oh, that's <laughs> Lil' Kim. I had heard about her before. But uh -huh. um, I think by, you know, initially I was kind of trying to, be cool with her. I mean, I think yeah. we were pretty cool. I see pictures yeah. where, you know, I had on her glasses, she had on mine, you know. Uh -huh. I was kind of being cool with her because I knew that was Big's artist, but mm -hmm. I didn't know anything about Sister. their um, involvement. You know, I didn't know they was in any kind of relationship, Sister. but mm -hmm. I was new. You know, I was new to their circle. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I wouldn't have known the history, and of course, he wasn't trying to tell me that shit. Because <laughs> <laughs> when I found out, of course, it was like, damn, you know, like, damn. What the fuck? All this time, right? You know? Right. But it's I can't say that, oh, she, you know, was some, oh, she's your friend, and then she, you know, it wasn't like that. Or, right. you know, we didn't really build a relationship or have a history outside of me meeting her through knowing that she's his artist and me already kind of being cool with the guys for a few months. And, you know, like, okay, let me, you know. He kind of said in the beginning, wanted me to kind of be around her, but I think that was just that dumb young shit, because then he realized why the fuck did I do that? <laughs> hey, oh, that was dumb. <laughs> Let me cut that <laughs> But now, I mean, I think, um, I mean, just to be clear, once Big passed away, any ill feelings toward her, you know, went out the window for me. Her and right. anybody else, you know? Right. It wasn't really anything to feel a way about. Right. But we didn't necessarily see each other and get to Conversate. There may have been a time or two that I ran into her and kind of tried.